Today, we're gonna to talk about the proper steps in cleaning and disinfecting the toilet. First, key step, most important step, is put on your PPE. PPE is personal protective equipment. For this process, really, the most important thing that we really need to use is gloves. We should always using, be using gloves anytime we're doing any cleaning or disinfecting. Protect yourself first. So now that I have my gloves on, the next step is when we go to the toilet, we want to, first thing that we do in a toilet is we want to move the excess water that's in the bowl of the toilet. By doing that, we can use either a bowl mop, commonly referred to as a Johnny mop, or a bowl brush. Either way is acceptable depending upon what you choose to use. When you're going to use and remove the water, it is a quick cup, fast motions. And what happens here is now what we basically take the water and we force it over the trap and we greatly minimize the amount of water that's now in the bowl. Once we've done that, we then take our disinfectant cleaner, first spray around the rim inside the bowl, and then we will spray the entire outside surface. Bottom of the seat, put the seat down, spray top of the seat, back, put the lid down, spray the lid behind, flush handles, we spray underneath. Very important that you do this process early in cleaning a bathroom. Why? Simply to give a disinfectant dwell time. All disinfectants have a required wet dwell time. Refer to the label, it will tell you how long that disinfectant needs to fully sit wet, continually wet, in order to do its job. Uh, then go about your process of cleaning the rest of the restroom. Then when you come back, take your bowl brush, agitate around, We gave it dwell time. You can flush or you can just let that product sit. Uh, do recommend that you take your paper towel now uh, when you're done and wipe your touch points, which would be the seat and the flush handle. The other areas you can allow to air dry. No problem with that. Thank you.